Good evening, everyone, as we get into the Lord's Word one more time today, one more time to see what He has to tell us today. And I know it's going to be good, it's going to be wonderful, because it always is. And my friends, it's the only truth we have in this world that we can count on and depend on. Because these words will help us all along the way. And people listen to them, they watch them, and make them clean, and they also can be saved and ready to go home one day when the morning comes. Our most kind and gracious Heavenly Father, it's again we come to you today, Lord, with thank, thank you one more time, Lord. I, I for your love and your mercy, I, I we thank you one more time, Lord, I, for the words you have given us today. I, and I pray, O oh Lord, today, I, you to anoint these lips of clay I, and give us wisdom, Lord, I, to speak your word with understanding I, that will help us all, I, myself included, I, I walk closer to you I, and have a stronger desire uh, and hunger uh, to follow your word and your your word uh, and and your uh, uh, the teaching Lord uh, because we know Lord uh, you are the living word uh, from the beginning to the end uh, and every word is true uh, and settled in heaven Lord uh, and I pray oh Lord uh, you give us something to say today uh, that will reach someone uh, along the way uh, and I pray Lord you bless uh, everyone today uh, that listen to this video uh, that you will fill them uh, with your Holy Spirit Lord uh, and let them know, Lord, they're sealed, I, I secure in your hands, I, and I pray, O oh Lord, I, that you anoint every word I, that's said in night, I, and Lord, I, not read your word, return void, I, and you've already said you wouldn't, Lord, I, and I pray you will accomplish I, I, where you sent it today, I, and I pray your word I, will be written on the table of our heart, Lord, I, that we know not to sin I, again, you, Lord, I, and God us. I, I pray, Lord, you guide us on uh, as we travel down life's road uh, and give us what we need to say uh, that it reach, reach some lost soul uh, uh, somewhere uh, and point them to you, Lord, uh, the Savior uh, that save uh, uh, them uh, and make us all a fit subject for heaven uh, uh, one day uh, that we can live in you, this world, Lord, uh, and share your gospel uh, uh, to the lost and dying world uh, and and give them another chance to be saved uh, before it's too late. Uh, and again, I ask you, Lord, uh, to guide us today. Uh, and we'll give you all the praise. Uh, I give you all the glory. Uh, in the wonderful name of the Lord and Savior, uh, uh, Jesus Christ. Uh, and amen. Uh, and thank you, Father, one more time uh, for your word uh, uh, and your love uh, and for your mercy. Now today we're going to be looking into the third chapter of 1 Corinthians. Uh, and I know it ain't been long since we've been in this scripture. Uh, but the Lord has led me back to it today. Uh, therefore I'm going to go uh, with this this chapter today uh, because there's something in there uh, that somebody needs to hear again uh, uh, my friend my friend uh, I never reject God's word uh, uh, if it's been preached to you a hundred times uh, uh, if we heard it a thousand times uh, let's go with it my friend uh, because there's something there uh, he wants us to know uh, that we didn't get uh, uh, somebody didn't get uh, uh, the other time uh, and we know Oh, my friend, uh, uh, this word is a living word, uh, and ever will be, uh, and it is settled forever in heaven. Uh, now let's see what it said. Uh, uh, 1 Corinthians, uh, uh, third chapter, uh, and a book, King James Version Bible, uh, that I always read, uh, and that I'm not ashamed of. Uh, uh, neither am I ashamed of the Lord uh, uh, Jesus Christ, uh, and confess Him to be my Lord uh, and my Savior, uh, because I know He is the 
one. I, I paid the ultimate price I, I, for a son Calvary I, that we could be saved I, and not be lost. I, now listen what he said I, in verse 3, chapter 3, I, and verse number 1. I, and I, brethren, could not speak I, unto as unto spiritual, I, but as unto carnal, I, even as unto babes I, in Christ. I, or someone that never growed up, I, my friend, I, and see what it says. I, I have fed you with milk I, and not with meat. I, I power other too. I, you were not able to bear it. I, neither now are ye able. I, I, my friend, my friend, my friend, I, there are many today I, are not able to bear the strong meat I, of God's holy word I, only because I, they have not grown in the scripture. I, I, my friend, I, and I say again, and I said, I have said before, I, my friend is more to be in the Christian. I, I, my friend is saying I, that I am. I, my friend is more to be saved I, than saying that we are. I, I, my friend, now I, I, let's go on to see I, I, what he said. I, verse three: I, For you are yet carnal. I, I, for whereas there is among you I, in being and strife I, and divisions. I, are ye not carnal and walk uh, as men? Uh, for, for while one saith, uh, I am of a Paul, uh, and another, I am of a Paulus, uh, are ye not carnal? Uh, uh, my friend, are ye not in the flesh? Uh, and my friend, is not in the spirit? Uh, that's what in the carnal means. Uh, my friend, my friend, my friend, uh, uh, God is a spirit, uh, and we got to listen to him uh, as a spirit, uh, and listen to him, uh, uh, what he said us, uh, my friend and God's word, uh, my friend whether we like it or not uh, it's still God's word and my friend, uh, and it is uh, still the truth uh, and my friend, we gonna be judged uh, by the words that are written in this book uh, uh, my friend today, uh, so therefore, uh, we need to wake up uh, uh, to the truth of God's word uh, and my friend, we need uh, uh, to keep the dust uh, off our Bible uh, and keep the dust off the altar uh, uh, where we used to pray. Uh, my friend, my friend, uh, we're in the greatest need of prayer uh, than we've ever been in. Uh, uh, since we've been living uh, upon this earth, uh, and my friend, uh, everywhere you turn and everywhere you look, uh, we see trouble on every side uh, that you mention it. Uh, it's trouble, my friend, and it's there uh, because Jesus said uh, it would be, uh, and it will be, and it will come, uh, uh, my friend, uh, as he said it would, uh, my friend, therefore, uh, we need to hold on uh, uh, to God's unchanging hand, uh, and put our hands in his, uh, and walk with him uh, all the days of our life, uh, and pray each day uh, to walk closer to him, uh, and listen to what uh, he has to say. Uh, now let's go on uh, a little farther, uh, uh, verse 4, uh, while one says, I am of a Paul, and another I am of a Paulus. Are you not carnal? Who then is Paul, and who is Paulus? But ministers by whom ye believed, even as the Lord gave to every man. My friend, he gave to every man that they could believe, or turn him away. My friend today, if we truly and believe in Almighty God, and when we pray to him, I will save us, my friend. I, he will save us. I, he saved us I, a long time ago, my friend. I, but my friend, I, because we are saved, my friend, I, he don't give us a license I, I, to go and sin and do anything I, I, we want to. I, I'm not saying that we are perfect, my friend, I, but we'll watch I, I, what we do and what we say I, and where we go. I, now let's go on. I, and what see what he said to say huh? Verse 6, I, I have planted uh, a Paul's water, uh, but God gave the increase. Uh, other words, uh, uh, Paul planted it, uh, and Paul's come along, uh, and he watered it. How did he water it? Uh, uh, with the continuous uh, in the Word of God, uh, and preaching and teaching the Word of God. Uh, uh, God said, uh, my friend, uh, that's how he watered it, my friend. Uh, and God gave uh, uh, the increase, uh, because only God... Uh, 
that I can make things grow. Uh, my friend, my friend, my friend, uh, uh, where are we at today? Uh, uh, where do we stand? Uh, in God's holy word today, uh, and my friend, uh, let's not build ourselves uh, upon a pedal stood too high, my friend, uh, uh, because we do. Uh, we are sure to come tumbling down, uh, uh, because uh, all the power is in God's uh, holy hand, uh, in the hands of the Lord, uh, and therefore we need to listen to him uh, when he speaks to us uh, uh, through his word. I uh, from the portals of heaven, Lord, my friends, uh, that we hear him, uh, and that we will follow him and not follow man, uh, uh, because we can't follow man, uh, uh, because, my friend, uh, if we follow man, my friend, uh, they can take us to one place, uh, and that's down, 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 uh, to the place below, uh, but my friend, uh, if we will follow the Lord, uh, uh, Jesus Christ, uh, our good shepherd, uh, uh, then he will lead us uh, all the way home, uh, uh, my friend, uh, and then, my friend, uh, when it comes the time for us to go, uh, and leave this world, uh, and he calls our name, uh, uh, then we can lay down this old cross, uh, uh, we had to carry, uh, uh, day by day, uh, my friend, and go home to live with him forevermore. Oh, praise and glorify his holy name. If you know today that you have been saved and you're ready to go home in the morning when he calls, then give him some praise and give him some glory while we still can and while we are able, my friends. Because, my friends, he is worthy of all praise and honor and glory that can be given unto him. And while we're on this earth, my friend, uh, we can never praise him. Uh, I glorify him uh, enough uh, for what he had done for us, uh, my friend. Uh, he died on the old rugged cross, uh, my friend, that we will not have uh, to die lost uh, and go down to that devil's hell, uh, my friend. Uh, that was not prepared for mankind, uh, but for the devil and his angels, uh, uh, my friend. Uh, Therefore, if you know, my friend, uh, you are ready to go uh, uh, when he calls. Uh, that's why I say, my friend, uh, give him the praise and give him the glory, uh, because he is worthy, uh, uh, my friend. Uh, now let's go on. Uh, so that, verse 7, uh, so then neither is he uh, that planteth anything, uh, neither he that watereth, uh, but God that give the increase. Uh, now he that uh, planteth and he that watereth are one, and every man shall receive his own reward according to his own labor. My friend, today, if we went to glory today, if this was the day he called us away, what would be our reward? My friend, we don't have to answer this question. We have to answer it to ourselves. Ask our own selves, my friend. This question today, uh, what would be our reward uh, if he called us today? Uh, my friend, my friend, my friend, uh, I pray everybody uh, would go get a great reward uh, of eternal life in heaven uh, uh, someday. Uh, now listen, 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 uh, I do what God had to say. Uh, and my friend, uh, if we will listen to what he said, uh, then we will be blessed along. Uh, by the way, uh, my friend, uh, we may not have uh, everything that we want, uh, my friend, uh, but he will supply our needs uh, uh, for it's sufficient uh, to carry us home uh, and through this world, uh, my friend. Uh, now listen, listen, listen uh, uh, to what he says, uh, uh, verse 9, uh, for we are the laborer, uh, for we are the laborers, uh, uh, for we are... 
Now that God planteth, and he that watereth are one, and every man shall receive his own reward according to his own labor, for we are labor together with God. Ye are God's husband, dearie, ye are God's building. My friend, what is he, what he said? That we are God's building, my friend. Other words, we are the church, my friend, my friend. It ain't the building the house we're in. Uh, my friend, uh, the beauty is inside of us. Uh, uh, my friend, uh, it's what's inside of us uh, that God is placed in there uh, uh, that makes up the church, my friend. Uh, it's not the building, uh, but it's in what uh, is in the heart uh, of the born again and saved. Uh, my friend, today, uh, I don't take my word for it, uh, my friend, uh, but take God's word uh, as it is written, uh, my my friend, and let's be preaching this gospel, this truth, to the lost and dying world, wherever they may be, that they'll have an opportunity to accept you as their Lord and Savior, and to help them find out, my friend, that there is a God, and they'll have no excuse on the great judgment day to say it was someone else's fault, the reason they didn't make it. My friend, my friend, my friend, I, I be sure we teach I, I God's word as it is written. I, and that's what he meant to, for us to do. I, at number 10, I, according to the grace I, of God which is given I, unto me. I, as a wise master builder, I, I have laid the foundation I, and another builds other on. I, but let every man take heed I, how he builds thereupon. My friend, my friend, my friend, my friend, let's build upon the foundation of the Lord Jesus Christ, because he is the foundation, my friend, that will never mar or decay, but stand forever. And my friend, my friend, my friend, when this old world is burning down and melting with fervent heat, that foundation of God, uh, we'll stand sure, uh, my friend, uh, he will never decay uh, or vanish away, uh, because far uh, I cannot hurt it, uh, and termites cannot mar its foundation, uh, because on the rock of uh, ages it stand, uh, my friend, my friend, my friend, uh, be sure you build upon uh, that foundation, uh, now listen to what he said, uh, uh, verse 11, uh, for other foundation can and no man lay uh, than that is laid, uh, which is Jesus Christ. Uh, now if any man uh, build upon this foundation of gold, silver, uh, uh, precious stones, uh, wood, hay, stubble, uh, every man's work uh, shall be made manifest or proven, uh, uh, my friend, uh, for the day shall declare it, uh, because it shall be revealed by fire, uh, and the fire uh, shall try every man's work uh, of what to Lord is if a man's word, any man's work, a bad which he hath built thereupon, he shall receive a reward. That's why I said today, that's why I ask ourselves a question today, my friend, what would be our reward if we went on to meet him today? And my friend, my friend, my friend, we very well could go on today because we made never see tomorrow, but my friend, if we do see tomorrow, what will be our reward at the end of the way? My friend, my friend, my friend, let's ask ourselves this thing over and over again until we get the message that God is the everlasting foundation upon which we must stand if we're going to endure. Now listen what it said, 
Verse 16, Do ye not that ye are the temple of God, and that the Spirit of God dwelleth in you? If any man defile the temple of God, him shall God destroy, for the temple of God is holy, which temple ye are. My friend, my friend, my friend, this goes back to say, my friend, to prove that, my friend, it ain't the building my friend, but we are the building, we are the temple of God, and if we defile this temple with the world, my friend, something contrary to God, my friend, then our foundation will not stand, because it will go tumbling down, my friend, because the world foundation is not good, but my friend, the foundation of the Lord, uh, uh, Jesus Christ uh, will stand today and forevermore, uh, uh, my friend. Uh, that's why we must build upon uh, uh, the Lord uh, Jesus Christ, uh, the true and sure foundation, uh, my friend, my friend. Uh, and then we will stand, uh, my friend. Uh, let's go on a little farther. Uh, let no man deceive himself. Uh, if any man among you uh, seem to be wise in this world, uh, let him become a fool, uh, that he may be wise. Uh, what is he talking about here? Uh, they will become a fool to the world, uh, my friend, and what they have. Uh, but accept the Lord Jesus Christ uh, as our Savior, uh, and build upon him, uh, both true and firm, uh, upon the foundation, uh, that he will stand for sure. Uh, and all the, my friend, uh, everything in the world has been thrown uh, at the foundation, uh, but it's still strong today uh, as it ever was, uh, and my friend, uh, because my friend, we are the temple of God, uh, then we got to build, be built upon uh, uh, that foundation, uh, my friend, my friend, uh, that everlasting foundation uh, of the Lord uh, uh, Jesus Christ, uh, that's why I ask the question to ourselves, uh, uh, what would be our reward uh, if we went today. Uh, now let's go on uh, a little farther. Uh for in the wisdom of this world uh, is foolish uh, uh, with God. Uh, for it is written, uh, He taketh the wise in their own uh, uh, craftiness. Uh, uh, my friend right here, uh, if we look around that history, uh, my th friends, uh, uh, things that happened many, many times uh, uh, through history, uh, um, when they planned great things, it didn't go through, uh, my friend, uh, because they left God out of it. Uh, and my friend, uh, therefore their plans, their thing, uh, I came tumbling down, uh, it did not stand, uh, just like many years ago, uh, uh, when they built uh, that great ship they called uh, uh, the Titanic, uh, uh, my friend, uh, you don't want to hear nobody speak about that today, uh, but my friend, uh, uh, when they built that great ship, uh, they said what they would do. Uh, they said they'd build a, build a ship uh, that water could not go through, uh, and they, some made a statement uh, that God couldn't sink that ship. Uh, my friend, uh, he proved to the world and all uh, in it, uh, that God, man's word will not stand, uh, but God's word will. Uh, I stand forever. I never come to the conclusion I, that God can't do anything. I, I, my friend, I, my friend, I, my friend, if we not build upon him, I, I, then we will sure I, I come tumbling down, I, my friend. I, and when we hit bottom, I, we'll know why we fell. I, and my friend, I, it won't be easy. I, my friend, my friend, my friend, I, hold on here to him today uh, and cling to God uh, on ch changing hand uh, my friend uh, and follow him all the way uh, my friend uh, follow him all the way through this world uh, he said lo I go with you all the way uh, even to the end of the world uh, my friend that is a God I serve uh, uh, that we serve uh, if we've been saved and born again uh, and we are standing uh, upon that solid foundation uh, my friend 
word of God and the Lord Jesus Christ because he is the living word from the beginning to the end. Therefore, if we gonna stand, my friend, we got to be built upon him or it won't stand. Now, to verse 20, and again, the Lord knoweth the thoughts of the wise that they are vain, my friend. Those that know it all, my friend, their thought is vain because it's on the things of the world and not on the things of God and not knowing, recognizing it and know that God has all the the power in this world and all the riches are in his hands. And my friend, we cannot deny God and stand upon that solid foundation. My friend, my friend, my friend, I did again, I must ask this question that we won't forget. If we left this world today, if this was our last day, what would be our reward at the end of our journey, my friend? Now, verse 21, Therefore, let no man glory in men, for all things are yours. My friend, we're not to glory in things of man, things that man build with his hand, but we're to glory in God, glory in the Lord, the one that died for us on the old rugged cross, and forgave our sins, that we would not have to die lost. I pray and glorify his holy name the holy name of Jesus our Savior my friend my friend praise his holy name with every thought every word that you can because he's worthy to be praised my friend it is him that paid the ultimate price for us we didn't die for him but he died for us on the old rugged cross my friend my friend, uh, give him the praise, uh, give him the glory, uh, because they do and worthy uh, of the whole praise. Uh, now listen what he continues to say, uh, these next few verse, two couple of verses, uh, up there for, uh, let no man glory in men, uh, for all things are yours, uh, uh, whether poor or polis, uh, or cephas, uh, of the world, uh, our life, uh, our death, our things present, uh, our things to come uh, all are yours uh, and uh, ye are Christ and Christ is God uh, my friend my friend uh, there is our assurance uh, my friend uh, if we belong to God uh, uh, through new birth uh, then we belong to Jesus also uh, we belong to the whole family uh, of God uh, my friend uh, and if we belong